Amity. Amity is the printing press in China where we uh, print all our Bibles, and not only we. People from all over the world are printing their Bibles there. An Amity Printing Company is the biggest printing printers of Bibles in the whole world. And yesterday, the 11 of November, we celebrated the completion of the 200 million Bible uh, printed by Amity. Uh, we are we had a big celebration there. I went with Father Jose Chirucara, and uh, you can see, for example, there in the background is the warehouse where there are around 3.5 million Bibles right now. This is uh, one of our books, the Chinese Daily Gospel, and we are here with Father Jose. Uh, it's a little bit late for uh, the printing of that this year, but uh, we'll soon be in all the parishes in China, where we distribute about 90,000, 100,000 copies. It was a very formal affair, and uh, there were people really from all over the world. But we have a team of uh, uh, persons there who we have worked with them for over 10 years. I have been in the, uh, doing business with them, uh, printing for more than 20 years. So uh, there is a very special relationship with the Claritians and the Claritian Publications and Pastoral Bible Foundation. Here is the director of the press uh, giving me one page of the first Chinese Bible printed in, uh, in 1919. It, it's a very formal affair, there were banquets, uh, we had to be with a lot of people, interaction there with people of the press especially, and uh, there were also awards for many people. And uh, I received, uh, Pastoral Bible Foundation received a very important uh, recognition uh, at, that, at that moment. Also, Claritian Publications of the Philippines, since we have been working with them for many years. And uh, here is the uh, one person with a lot of responsibility in the press and the people who are helping us. In the background, you can see how uh, the 200 millions of the Bible came to exist. And this is Divine. Divine has been working with me for 27 years. Actually, Divine and myself is what we say is Pastoral Bible Foundation, the two of us, basically. And then other people who help for different projects. And um, um, we were there at Divine uh, showing some Bibles that we are printing uh, for Brazil. This is the Ave Maria Bible. All the Bibles that you see there are going next week uh, in containers uh, for Brazil, for Ave Maria. Now, we print many Bibles for Brazil every year. Uh, we have very close to one million copies of books and Bibles that we print every year in Amity. And uh, there was a celebration with uh, moments of prayer, moments of thanksgiving, moments of celebration. Uh, uh, they display the Bibles printed throughout the years. And while the people were listening to a lot of uh, speeches and uh, uh, we escaped from that with our friends because we, we know them very well. And uh, we took a, a special tour of the printing press because with us, the small group, there were some who were going there for the first time. So uh, a couple of us were explaining how the, the, the work of the press goes on. And uh, there are 500 workers that are there at the press uh, working in different books at the same time. I'm explaining to them here about uh, the, how we prepare the daily gospel in Chinese. And you can see there, you know, then they cut it in half and uh, you have the, the copies ready to go. And uh, yeah, it was a very joyful moment and joyful encounter there. It, it shows there how the paper is pressed before it goes to the smile sewing machine and binding so that uh, the book will be consistent and with personality. Very formal banquets and songs and speeches. And here we are back at the press. Uh, it's huge. It is huge. It's unbelievably big. And you don't see a piece of paper on the floor. Uh, it's very clean and very friendly with us because we, are, we know them already. And. Um, you can appreciate there uh, the, the scope of this huge printing press. And all the workers are very well treated. Uh, to print a Bible now, the cost is more than double than before because there is social security for the workers, there is increasing salaries. And this lady here, Yan Yan, 
She is in charge of sending all the Bibles out to the whole world, about six containers a day. A huge responsibility because customs and uh, vessels around the world, they all have their own problems. Every country has their own rules and we have to be ready for everything. And there was a moment for a speech, so I had to give a short speech to the guests. And uh, I started saying that uh, in Hebrews 4.12, we see that the, the Word of God is living and effective, passing through so many hands that none of them are Christians, and going to bring Jesus' good news to the rest of the world in so many languages and millions of copies. And my prayer was that uh, the blessings that the people received, reading, meditating, praying with the Bible, will rebound to the hearts of the workers there, so that their life also will be full of meaning, of love, of joy, and hope. And uh, you can see there a little bit of the, the people attending the banquet. And I also said that uh, in, uh, you know, in business, <clears throat> what we expect is price, delivery on time, and uh, quality, perhaps a little bit of credit line, but what gathered us there was something deeper than that. It was a relationship of uh, like a family, a sense of belongingness that we have, because we have received a lot of favors from them. And uh, the relationship that we have is very unique. You know, I don't know if I should say that too hard to, 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 to allow, but uh, you know, we really, we don't sign contracts with them. It's just the word of mouth. And uh, of course, not with everybody, but the trust that goes has been built up for more than 20 years, it shows there. And the appreciation that the owners of the, the, the people and the, the people working there have for us, for Clarition Publications and Pastoral Bible Foundation, is huge. And uh, they made us really feel like uh, part of that family there. And, uh, well, that was yesterday, uh, 11 of November. Uh, 1111 is Singles Day in China. And uh, it's a day where all the prices are going down. People buy um, things online. And they, they bought yesterday the, the amount of, uh, I think it was 40 billion US dollars. 40 billion. The irony of that is that with 200 million Bibles produced in Amity in China, the Bible is not allowed to be sold in that country. That is the sad part of it. Still, through the years, with permission from the government, about 80 million copies of the Bible have been distributed free to people, mainly by the Protestants, and 120 million go uh, abroad in different and about 100 plus languages that they print. And uh, we hope and pray that one day uh, the Word of God could really go freely in this beautiful country that is China. And uh, you can see there uh, beautiful choirs and people singing and enjoying. Uh, and uh, we are back now to our daily lives, back to reality after this beautiful celebration with the, the strength and the willingness to keep on working on the Word of God as much as we can. Our main project right now is the translation of a new translation of the Bible into Chinese, which is a huge task and we hope that one day we will be able to publish also that, of course, in Amity as well. Thank you for listening.